Hi everyone, welcome to Patty's Polish Corner. Today is our YouTubers Weekly Stamping Nail Art Collab. And hosting this week is Jay Lee's Nails. And the theme is triple stamping. That was incredibly hard. <laughs> um, I could do a ton of double stamping and then I had to throw a third a third stamping in there for triple stamping so but I, I got it I finally got um one that I really liked and I created it and I hope you guys like it too it also happens to be day two of my 12 days of Christmas themed nail art mini series so i hope you enjoy this one let's take a look at everyone's designs mine will be the last and then i will show you how i created it all the links from the ladies who participated this week are in the description box below so check out their um their videos and like and follow <laughs> but right now let's take a look at everyone's designs and let's get started For this video, I'll be using my Wave Gel base coat and I'll be using the shiny No Clean Top Coat. I'll be using Wave Gel's Snow Ice and I'll be using Wave Gel's um, Hearts on Fire. And this is similar to the um, Holiday Cheer except for it has bigger chunks of red glitter in it. I have already applied two coats of Hearts of Fire and two coats of Snow Ice on all of my fingers, and I have put liquid latex around um, to protect my fingers from staining um, of the stamping polish. From the Twinkled Tea Frost Stamping Fa Polish Collection, I'll be using Icy, which is a pearl white, and Swerve, which is a beautiful kind of metallic-y red. Um, these are gorgeous. I am going to link Twistar's um, uh, video in the description box below it because she did a swatch of the whole collection and she's completely amazing and there's just no way I could do that swatch video any better so I'll just link hers down below she also has a discount code with Twinkle Tea for 10% off and I picked up the entire collection for it was for $32 and there was six polishes in it so that's just I think that came up to be like getting a free polish. So um, I really like these. These are awesome. And I'll also be using my Hit the Bottle. And it is See What I Green. I'll be using my Moyu Stamper and Scraper. And for the stamping plate, I'm going to be using Uber Chic Christmas. O2. Oh, this is a fun plate. Okay, first I'm going to go for like a white on white look. And I got the idea on Twice Star's video because she always does her um, stamping swatches over white and black. And this pearl um, just gave it a really um, light, delicate kind of, you know, 
look on there. It looked pretty cool. So, and I'm going to use this Christmas tree as the background pattern for the triple stamping. Now this isn't gonna quite fit on my entire nail. So I'm gonna do like one half. And then I'm going to pick it up again and do the other half. Sorry, I did not have my camera on <laughs> when I um, put the stamping polish on. Oh, I really like how that looks. That is, that's pretty amazing. The thumb is a little trickier to do because um, it's bigger. So I'm going to have to try to get a little bit in right here where there's no pattern. So I'll just go for a little thin part right here. And turn it like this. There. Perfect. Now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put a uh, shiny no clean top coat just between um, this stamping portion and the next one. I was kind of hoping for, you know, more of a 3D look by doing that, but I really don't think that's going to happen. <laughs> um, otherwise I would have to have the coats like too thick and my nails are too short to do that. Next, I'm going to use the Holly um, image right here, and I'm going to use my new Ajubis stamper. I got them in a three-pack on Amazon, so I'll link the information below. They were $7.99 for three, and all of them come with these cute little caps with these crystals on them, which I completely love. I'm such a dork. <laughs> I, it just looks so pretty on my desk with my stamping things, so that's pretty cool. So it actually came with three, the package that I got, and they work amazing. So here's the, oops, that's not the one. That's the one I had before, the clear one. Okay, so this one is three white ones, and they have pink, purple, and kind of a peachy color in the caps. And they came with three thick scrapers, which are nice, but I'm not going to use those. I'm just going to use this little Moyu one that's already um, been used. Um, the reason why I'm switching stampers is because this image is a little bit hard to pick up with my Moyu stamper. I don't know why. Um, and my sticky stamper is huge, so I, I wanted something a little bit smaller. So that's why I'm going with this. The Polish down and then scrape it. I don't know why I'm always getting a line on this side. Whatever. Okay, and then I've got a good pickup. So now I'm just going to kind of kind of eyeball where I want it. It turned out really good. So I'm going to do that with my other fingernails. Okay, so now what I did was I removed some of the leaves because I wanted some of the background to show. And um, I know from when I was testing it, there's just like way too many leaves close together. So I did that and I put a um, shiny no clean top coat over the top because um, if you mess up, <laughs> then you can just wipe it away. <laughs> so that's pretty awesome. Um, and again, um, that's why I, there was a good idea to put a top coat over the um, the background stamping as well. All right, so now we're going to attempt to get the holly berries in the correct place. And for that, I will be able to use um, this little stamper. 
it, you have to use a clear stamper or it will never work. But this one um, seems to pick up the holly berries just fine. I was just having a little bit of issue with it picking up the whole entire image on the leaves. I don't know what the deal was with that. Really don't know. Don't like the leaves for some reason. Well, I guess it would be good to not drop your stamper on the big mess. So let's try this again. Okay, now I get to line up clusters of berries where they should be, and I think I have a match right there. You know what? That didn't really work out well. I'm going to get rid of it and come back. Oops, I'm out of focus too. Okay, so here we go again. I think I have an idea. Okay, so I've got these little berries, and these ones can go right here. Well, that looks good. And this group of three can go right here. And that looks good. Ooh. And this group can go right here. I like that, and I'll just get rid of that, and we'll have to get some more berries. Okay, I'll pick up some more berries. It's like those three for right here. And... Those three right here. Okay. And those three can be right here. And these three <laughs> can be Right there. Okay, so I'll just remove all the leftover berries. Okay, so here's the finished look. I hope you liked the video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you're not one of my subscribers, please subscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.